Hello everyone. Today, we will go through the steps to unlock sensitive content on Twitter, now known as X. By default, Twitter hides content that is considered sensitive, such as graphic or violent posts. If you want to view this type of content, you will need to change some settings. Since the X mobile app does not allow you to do this directly, we will need to use a web browser to access the full settings. Start by opening any web browser on your device. You can use Google Chrome, Safari or any other browser. In the search bar, type Twitter or X and go to the official website. If the website redirects you to the app, go back to the browser, long press on the website link and select Open in New Tab. This will ensure that the page loads in the browser instead of opening the app. Once you are on the website, Log in to your Twitter account if you are not already signed in. After logging in, tap on your profile picture in the top left corner of the screen. A menu will appear on the left side. Scroll down and select Settings and Privacy. This will take you to the main settings page. Next, find and select the option called Privacy and Safety. This section controls what kind of content you can see on your account. Scroll down and look for Content You See. Tap on this option to open the settings related to media and sensitive content. There are two important settings that need to be changed. The first setting is Display media that may contain sensitive content. By default, this option is turned off, meaning Twitter hides sensitive content. To allow sensitive media to appear in your feed, turn this option on. The second setting is inside the Search Settings section. Tap on it to open the search preferences. Here you will see an option called Hide Sensitive Content. If this option is enabled, Twitter will filter out sensitive content from your search results. To allow sensitive content in searches, turn this setting off. After making these changes, you will now be able to view sensitive content in your X or Twitter app. If you are still not seeing the content, try closing and reopening the app. Sometimes it may take a few minutes for the changes to take effect. That's it. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.